Hi everyone, this is Cyrus for iPhoneS.com. Today I'm reviewing and covering the best meteor shower applications for iPhone and iPad. We had the chance to cover it on our site, iPhoneS.com in the list, but I just wanted to show you guys some of the apps that we use to keep track of meteor showers, upcoming, upcoming ones, and see them in the, in the sky. So when you are choosing an application in this category and for this specific purpose, you're either one going to have an app that shows you the upcoming meter showers, covers the events, it helps simplifies the job for you, or it shows you places that you can go to to catch these events, specifically areas that have less light pollution so you can actually see what you're looking at. Not all of these meteor showers are easy to catch. You want to be prepared and have your equipment ready. So having these apps helps. So for figuring out the upcoming meteor showers, Meteor Guide is a pretty awesome application. It shows you a different list of what's coming up, what's happening today, what's coming up in the future. So it has you covered as far as the forecast goes as far as you can select the years in the in advance to get information so you go all the way there you can go to 2014 so you don't really have to worry about it there are some applications in the app store meter meter shower applications that were great in 2011 but it stopped updating these guys have updated this frequently and they have you covered till 2014 and even after that so you can always catch these and set up alerts so that's one meter shower calendar that's another one it's a free application that gives you a basic view of what's coming you can see exactly that start peak end date get information on them. It's a free application. I wouldn't say it's better than the other one, but at the same time it does support notification reminders, shows upcoming sunrise, sunset information. You can get background information there. beginning date, the ending date, approximately peak date. So all that information is available for you. So these are the apps that show you the dates. Then we have Dark Sky, which is one of my favorites and we've been reviewing, reviewed it already a couple of times on YouTube and our site. This application is special because it helps you find areas that you can take advantage of dark skies. So you can use your telescope and equipment or your eyes, whatever the case may be, to catch these astronomical and these meter shower events or just go and watch the sky for whatever reason. You can also add your own dark sky. You can choose different types of maps, see the light pollution, Dark sites you can take advantage of with information. So it has you covered. You do have the scales to see exactly what you're looking at as far as light pollution goes. The sky chart, go back here. So you have the hybrid view, you have the regular view, you have the satellite view. And if you have a place that you want to add, you just and help others, this app has you covered. Sky Map is, I wouldn't say it's a media shower application. It's just a classic astronomy application that just shows you what you're looking at in the sky. So for beginners who are not experienced with the stars and moon phases, constellations, things like that, this application has you covered. You can turn on and off different features as you like. So my choice is if you are supposed to get two apps, I would get Dark Sky 
and Meteor Shower Guide because they're the most complete ones and they com complement each other. They help you keep up with the upcoming events and they can also help you find dark sites. So they're great for amateur astronomy. I hope you enjoyed this summary of the best apps that we've found for Meteor Shower showers and schedules and keeping up with them. If you have any ad suggestions that you want us to add to our list, please add them in the comment section. For more information, please go to our list on iPhoneS.com. We're going to be updating in the future with even more apps. Thanks very much for watching, guys.